Hey guys, Joe for 1UP Reviews and today we've got a sneaker review and an unboxing of the Adidas Ultra Boost 21. Before we get into the review guys, if you're new to our channel, remember to hit that subscribe button, hit the notifications bell so you never miss any of our latest reviews. Slap some thumbs up, we want to see those likes and show some love in the comment section below. We try our best to reply to every single comment that's thrown at us. Let's get into it. So today we've got a look at the Ultra Boost, I don't know why I've said it like that, the Ultra Boost 21. And we've got this in the cool cloud white colorway with a solar yellow. And we've got this in a UK size 7.5, it's a US 8, and it's a European 41 and a third. And right off the bat, let's just go talk about the box. It's an unusual way to Open it, I think it's like a split diagonal here from Adidas. Easy access though, and it's a nice way to present the shoes as well. So, here we go. Okay, right. I mean, that's a lot of boost just by looking at it. So let's start with the outsole. So with this outsole, it is Adidas's LEP, and you've got a lot of continental rubber that surrounds it with the webbing. You've got the torsion that's always found here around the middle, and that's a lot of the Adidas staple runners and a lot of their sneakers, they have the torsion support. Inside, you can also see windows of the Boost technology as well. Going along onto the midsole, as I mentioned, you can see such a big proportion of that boost that's found in the heel. And it goes along all the way onto the midsole unit. If you can see even there. Go. And I do love boost. I'm always gonna compare these to the Ultra Boost like 1.0s, which I will do when I do the fit. But I mean, when you're looking at this, this doesn't look that too bad. It does resemble the 1.0 versions, but there's a lot more flair, a lot more gusto onto these, I believe. Now, what's great is that if you look into the upper, it's very similar. It's all prime, it, it very sock line fit. But if you look inside the insole where it says this prime blue, that indicates that a lot of the materials that make the upper are made from recycled plastics and it is part of Adidas's party ocean plastic scheme where they take a lot of the recycled bottles that they found in the ocean and it's all incorporated into this prime knit upper. The upper is not that too bad to look at you got a lot of fluorescent yellow that's found at the front and at the mid heel unit here. And this heel support system is plastic and you've got the Ultra Boost logo right there. Looking towards the cage, now the cage is very different. Instead of a monotone colouring system, we've got three black stripes and a very clear plastic cage a normal lace enclosure. If you look at the medial side, it says prime knit. An easy to slip on heel unit there. And it is essentially a sock liner, this sneaker. So you can always feel the comfort. It's always hugging your feet. It's like a Air Harachi, but obviously it's the newest one and you'll always find these sock line of fits in a lot of their runners, especially the Ultra Boosts. Just before I round it off, you've got on the tongue, a press of the Adidas logo. And unfortunately there are no spare laces that come with this. So I can't wait to try these on. I'm always gonna compare these to the 1.0s. I do have a love for Ultra Boost, so I'm gonna be as critical as I can. So roll that footage of me trying them on.
comes to the fit guys, I do recommend that you get your true to size Adidas fit. This is a UK size eight. I am, um, oh, forgive me. This is a UK size 7.5. When it comes to Adidas, I have a UK eight. Now these feel like they are proper hugging my feet. It's very tight on. However, it really is comfy. So if you wanna get a really snug fit, like as you can see, you can really see my toes coming up, then you can get your half size down. But if you want your true fit and it being not so suffocated, if that makes sense. I mean, these aren't properly suffocating my feet. It's just a bit tight. I should have said just tight. But if you don't want that tight feel, get your true size Adidas fit. Thanks guys for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow us at One Up Reviews with a Z at the end on Instagram. And until next time, peace.